Evening, Governor. Man, I don't know who you are, but your timing's impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Maybe. I do know she, know she. How are you, buddy? Minutemen, so I'm traveling backwards in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. God damn. So That's I lame. Up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last Minuteman left standing. Huh. Uh, I have my own problems, Garvey. Yeah? Like what? You help us, maybe we can help you. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. Who's around? Looking for a missing person. Looking for an infant boy. He's been kidnapped. My son Sean's been kidnapped. He's not even a year old. Let's go with that. That's messed up. I'm sorry. I know how this world can be. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. You suck. First, it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Uh, it's a cruel world, buddy. You think I don't know that? Nah, the things man. I've seen. The things I've done. That is a bubblehead. Hold up. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. God damn Those it. Those raiders proved us wrong. Just can't get this bubblehead, okay? But, well, we do have Just one. Just gonna idea. back away. All right, let's hear it. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school. I look Pretty like old. Elvis. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. I like it. <laughs> Accident skipped his dialogue. suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertebrate. <laughs> Do that. And those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? I dig, cuz. Uh, and I can use the minigun like a rifle, and I can work. It's a suicide mission. No, minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. So what's the solution? What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Already got one. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. I fix stuff. I also make songs. I'm Elvis. Yes, I did indeed remove the main character's voice because I don't like it, to be honest. I don't like that he's voiced, and if I read out the lines anyway, you just hear them twice, so it's really redundant. Uh, so, uh, I already grabbed the fusion core. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. Don't worry, buddy. I got this. I would like this rest, though, for a moment. Hang on, there's a book. You've collected an issue of Robco Fun. Includes the Atomic Command holotape game. Ah, okay. Interesting. Did not know that. I'm just gonna steal your coffee pot. Okay, don't mind me. I need it to scrap it to, uh, you know, build things. Need to build homes for you people, because you don't know this yet, but you're gonna live with me. Here? This is ridiculous. This it is, is ridiculous. Careful, kid. Shh. Something coming, and, and it's it's angry. It's gonna be me if you don't shut up. All right, let's wait around because I wanna again. A, I wanna see outside when I'm using this minigun, like you know, in the daytime. And also, I wanna show you. Uh, shut up, lady. Let's grab the bubble head before I forget. Boop. Perception. Fantastic. I wanna you know show you this. Team? Look at that shit. How pretty is the lighting? How good does that look? Don't even lie. How pretty is that? It looks even better when it's like almost, almost nighttime. Like when it's dusk. It looks badass. All right. Uh, is there anything else we could do? I mean, I guess we could talk to some of these fools. We could talk to the, the druggy old lady. Because, yes, she's a druggy. Yeah, the way. The goddamn way I'm looting. Hello, Mama Murphy. 
dog meat sure did find us some help. Just look at ya. So he's your dog? Aw, uh, he ain't my dog. No, sir. Dog meat, he's what you call his own man. You can't own a free spirit like that. But he chooses his friends and sticks with them. He'll stay by you now. I saw it. I'll trust us. That was really creepy. Uh, yeah, I do have the dog. I also have a pug as well. You saw it? It's the Kems, kid. They give old Mama Murphy. You dislike Mama sense. Murphy? Been that way for as long as I can remember. Then you're gonna love what I'm gonna do with her. Oh boy, that's it. I'm out of here. All right. I sometimes forget that folks ain't used to weird things like the sight. You go on. You go on. Where's me dog? See, look. Dog meat is white now. Racist. PewDiePie would love that, though. And pug meat. Where's your little pug? Who's, who's, a little, who's a little pug? Who's a little pug? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. So he follows dog meat around. Apparently does fight as well, though not very much from what I've seen. He promised. Go on, I'm listening. We can't just stay trapped in here. This is ridiculous. You're ridiculous. Somebody do something. Stop pacing. Put me off. I think where are we going? Bum ba dum ba dum ba dum bum bum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. We did loot this, didn't we? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we we've like taken everything that wasn't nailed down this damn building. Hello, Una Two. How you doing? Hopefully, I said that correct. Let's make a permanent save because it's been a while. Boop. All right. It's clobbering time. You hate her. Don't worry. You're, you're gonna love what we're gonna do with Mama Murphy. I got I got the perfect setup for her. All right, hold on. This thing's to take. Log SSG Michael Dealey or something. All right, hang on. Where is that? Oh God, no, 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 no. Drifter outfit. Way cooler. Way cooler. Anyway, so. Is it under miscellaneous or is it under data? I don't know where these logs go. I, I have no idea. Miscellaneous solid tapes. Here we go. Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, oh, Daly. Okay. While en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause. EMP following nuclear detonation. Day after that, several, in fact, this thing is ugly. Were, were shot by some the intel I've gathered this desperate survivors was a global event. Then Brzezanski took off running. Haven't seen him since. Now, it's my turn to go AWOL, if that concept even applies anymore. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so I guess my soldiering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot. To see if my sister's I'm gonna wait for this tape to be done before I carry on. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. I think he's done. Hooray! Uh, what faction am I joining? I do not know yet. Honestly, I do not know. Uh, another one I have lets you get in power armor quicker. As you can see, it does take 10 minutes. But yeah, you're gonna uh, you're gonna love what we're gonna do with Mama Murphy. I got I got big plans for her. All right, hang on. I know, I know. I need the minigun. I'm, I'm looting. I'm looting. I'm looting. I want this booty. Swiggity swiggity. All right, okay. Time to pick up the booty. Like I said, it's clobbering time. Can I use a uh, bullet time with this? Can't really, <laughs> can't really see where I'm aiming, but yes. Okay, done. Ah! Ah! Use the gun. Oh, that's not a dude. Thought it was a dude. That's my bad. Where are you going? Gooch. Can I blow these up? Nope. Okay, oh, hey. that's a rocket launcher. Put that down. Put that down right now. Holy shit. Fantastico. We need to go back for that rocket launcher. But not right now. No! Ah! No, God, please, no! no! <laughs> <laughs> so I forgot that I have a bot on that is uh, Steve Carell from The Office shouting, No, God, no, please, no, when you die. Uh, that will probably get old eventually, but I can always uninstall it when it does get old. But right now, I find that shit hilarious. A 
All right, anyway. <laughs> Especially because I keep forgetting that I have it on, and then it just comes up, and I'm like, oh, yeah. Okay. we. I think I died to the, the car that I set on fire, which is, uh... Whoa! You fucking sniped me out of it here! Is this survival? No, this is on very hard, but I have triple damage to enemies and to me. So, uh, yeah. I'm a glass cannon, but so are they. We need to get out of here. Fuck, no! Dude, this motherfucker. This motherfucker. All right, we need to be careful. We need to keep jumping into that rocket. All right, fire your rocket. Fire the rocket. Fire, fire the ro Okay, hang on. He fired the rocket. Okay, go. Go, 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 go. Everything has to die. No! By the way, this guy should probably not have a rocket launcher this fucking early in the game, which is why I'm getting wrecked. Like, he, he really kind of shouldn't have this. But it's a modded here? rocket launcher, which apparently he's spawned with, so... I don't know who's got it is the problem. I don't know where it's coming from. Oh, it's over there! Shit. Okay, I need to hide. I need to hide. I need to hide. There he is! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Please die! He's not dead. He's dead. Okay, we got him. Oh, thank God. I thought that was Pugby. For some reason, I thought that was a Pug- I'm so blind. You... Is that Preston? It's Preston. Okay. Uh... Where are the rest of them? I know there's a lot more. Oh, yeah, there you go. Ah! Holy shit. I see you up there. Kind of. Where'd Rocket Launcher McGee go? I really want that Rocket Launcher. We need to not leave before we get that. Hey, buddy. Bitch! Get <laughs> clobbered. <laughs> He's got a skeleton costume. Don't mind if I do. Holy shit. All right. Oh, damn. You know, I'm going to leave him alive so he distracts the... Uh, that thing. Yep, thank you. Appreciate it. So good. Oh god. Again, do not assume that this is like easy mode. I'm taking a shitload of damage here. I'm nearly dead, in fact. Ah, oh, we did it. Holy crap. Holy crap. It just speeds up the game, basically. Instead of everything being like bullet spongy, I way prefer it like this. There we go, we stimmed back up. Now, let's see if we can loot these dudes and hopefully find that bloody rocket launcher. Because we kind of killed him, like, right in the middle of nowhere. Uh, I think we have clan leathers. Let's check. Do I have clan leathers? Yes, I do. All right. We don't need, like, two sets of every army. In fact, I guess we have most of them for selling. Isn't there, like, a... Uh... Yeah, there's actually, like, a tunnel down there you can go into. You're not sure whether to go for survival? Yeah, I, I just didn't go with survival just because there's a lot of inconveniences, like only being able to save in certain places. Now, you can fix that with mods, but... Yeah, it also seemed like a lot of mods just weren't really built for survival mode. Like, a lot of them just seemed like the balance would go completely out the window, so... That was the other reason. Like, you know, this is as hard as survival just without the annoyances, so... You know. Having said that, I was... I... I've played, um... Oh, we found him. Sweet. I've played Fallout New Vegas all the way through probably at least twice, maybe three times. And every time I play on hardcore mode. But that guy, that game was designed with it in mind, you know? Uh, so, I don't know. I, I, think, uh, I think New Vegas hardcore works. I don't know if it works that well in this. Though I haven't really tried it. But it, it just seemed like a lot of mods wouldn't really work with it properly. So we have a bloody RPG now. So that's nice. We've got two rockets. Holy crap. It's got scope and everything. Let's, uh, let's give this bad boy a test. I am going to save, though, because I want to keep my, keep my ammo. Bug me, you might want to back up. Just saying. Is this thing, like, actually on fire now? Like, is it going to blow up? Because I'm sure that thing blew up on me before. That one blew up. Nice. Very nice. Apparently, this is going to die soon. Yep. Uh... You are not- you are not wrong, actually. Yeah, it's gonna run out of juice. 
We should do that, actually, yeah, because we could just travel back here, can't we? So let's just let's just quick travel to Red Rocket. Dump the power armor there. And then we'll, uh... Oh, God, excuse me, need to stretch. Oh, that's good. Yeah, we'll dump the power armor here before it runs out of juice. And then we will, uh... We'll come back. You do really like removing enemy position pips from the compass. So maybe I should go for survival, but not a lot. Yeah, you can, uh... To be honest, I mean, there are mods to do that as well. I think I have a mod that reduces the pips on the radius so that they don't show up unless they're, like, pretty close. Something like that. All right, anyway, let's put you here for now. Boop. Fantastico. Are we unrecumbered? Yes, I am not surprised. I fully expect it to be. So what we do is we store stuff in the workbench, which apparently is... I want this. Thank you. Okay, now, put our spare armor in here. Like, all of this. That can stay there. That's fine. Jumpsuit, Miniman Dirty Gloves, can I... Oh, that's right, there is... I do have a gloves mod. As weird as that might sound, there's just no gloves in the game normally. Except I'm wearing gloves with this. I guess they just come with this outfit. So what happens if I put them on together? They, like, oddly clip over the top. Oh, do they? Uh, I can't really tell. Yeah, I think, I think they look fine. No, they definitely clip. Okay, that's what I figured. All right. So when we do have something that doesn't have gloves with it by default, we can uh, we can chuck those on. So let's put this stuff away as well. That's like three bloody green hats. Sunglasses. Do they look better than what we have? Good questions. Have a look. No, nah, I actually prefer the other ones. Prefer the other ones. I think we're still we are still unencumbered. Holy crap! We should probably put the rocket launcher away because that's bound away a lot. Let's put that away for now. I don't think we'll need it right now. Holy crap, I have so much stuff. So much stuff. Good lord. Uh, we'll put our wedding ring... Wait, why am I not wearing the wedding ring? Excuse me? I think this one's mine. We'll wear our wife's. Neck wrap, don't need, don't need, don't need, don't need, don't need. And don't need these. Yep, okay. Fantastic. Alright. Am I wearing a shoulder piece? Hang on. Left arm. Right greaves. Oh, yeah, I am. I can see on the thing. Okay. It just doesn't look like a... Yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's not part of the armor. Okay, I see. It, look, it actually looks like it's part of the armor, the way it's... It's like the same color and everything. But it's like that little brown thing on our, sh our left shoulder. Right, anyway. Enough messing around. Let's go back to Concord and finish up the... The Museum of Freedom! Freedom! Push the T-button to store all. The minigun weighs a lot, Jason. That is true, yes. Uh, I did put the RPG. We, we can move for now. and we This shouldn't be too much we have to pick up here. We're pretty much just going to do the dialogue. I was really just trying to put the armor away before the, the fusion core ran out, because then you just plod along at the speed of nothing. So that would have sucked. All right, we back. Where's Pugmeat? There he is. Are you called Dogmeat now? Yes, you are. Fantastic. Woo. So, uh... We'll probably go with, like, one more companion along with the two dogs. Otherwise, it'll get, like, a little little OP in our favor if we have too many of them. Yeah, quit busting her balls, Pressy. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. Thanks, bud. I try. Uh, yeah, exactly. I'm on my own side, Garvey. That's a shame, man. You can never have too many friends in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. I want his gun. Look at that. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. Thanks, buddy. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Spoken like a true merc. Well, if you ever feel like fighting for something other than yourself, you should meet up with us in Sanctuary. I could use someone like you. Someone who can get things done. All right, I'm in. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more to your destiny, isn't there? I've seen it. I bet you have, you and creepy I bitch. Oh, your pain. Uh, don't give me this destiny crap. I just saw you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a 20-foot tall irradiated lizard. You telling me you can't keep an open mind after that? Touche, Monami. Touche. It's all right, Preston. 
Not everyone understands the sight. But I don't need you to believe. I just need you to listen. You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel... Your son's energy. He's alive. Is she blind? I don't actually know, to be honest with you. I think she's just high, perpetually. Bullshit! You're trying to blame me for a fool! Oh, no, kid. No. Have we got blackface back again? I think we do. Sometimes foggy, but it ain't ever a life. Your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. That's vague. Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No, Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk, it's gonna kill you. You need to get you off that shit. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. Yeah, our face has changed again. What the hell? Our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's like a it's clock. Safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not yeah, far. literally my home. About it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? it Welcome back, Big Bud. Hold on. Worse than everybody just take it easy. Now everybody you hold on. Together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then. Kill everybody. Is. Who said that? Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh, okay. Does Pugmy have balls? I mean, I don't know. Good question. Uh, yep, he's got a sack right there. Wow, well, they modeled everything, didn't they? Pugmy is a dude. Can confirm. Oh, I'm going first. See you, suckers. I'm a sucker like I said. Fucked up in the head. Not... Alright, so uh, we're probably going to do a little bit of building now, is my guess. Because we're going to make the sanctuary. I don't want to make it look pretty and stuff. By the way, another mod I have on, which may sound uh, not like a massive thing, but it, I really like it. It lets you lock doors. So, it means in settlements, you can lock a door to a house that you don't want your settlers just running in. Like, you know, my own house. You know, with Sean's crib and all that shit. Because, you know, they got to desecrate my house. I think you could do it to any door. Let's check. You cannot. Okay, interesting. So it must only work in settlements then. Uh, do you think you can give Pugmy armor? I don't believe so. I'm pretty sure the mod description said uh, that it wouldn't fit him. I've seen one of these things up close. I'm very glad it's already dead. We don't actually need to walk with these guys to Sanctuary. I don't know if there's much benefit to us doing so. We can go down to the sewers. Let's go have a look over here. Let's see if there's a... Uh... I don't know how big this is or anything, but we'll have a look. You hate the angry woman. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not super keen on. Uh, I'm super keen on any of them. Oh, by the way, uh, if they're still up there, let me show you something. I actually have another mod that lets you stealth kill people, and but if you do it on an essential NPC, you basically just knock them the fuck out, and they stay knocked out, unless you uh, kind of. Well, it's kind of weird. Uh, it seems to be kind of buggy, but I'll, I'll see if I can show you. One moment. Can you give Pug me power armor? I wish. Come back, you son of a bitch. No, I wanted to check the tunnel. I'm like freaking legging it now. I guess we'll come back to the tunnel then. There's so much stuff to loot around here. <gasps> Plants. Okay, come back. I'm trying to knock you out to show people how it works. Mama said knock you out. I might have to wait for them to stand still, otherwise I don't think it's going to work terribly well. But yeah, I believe if you do it on uh, like an aggressive NPC, like you sneak up on them, you can actually do like a full on stealth kill. With the animation and everything. It's very cool. But yeah, when you do it to uh... Well, you'll see, you'll see. We're basically back to Sanctuary now. So, mm, do I want to Yeah, I'll move the power armor to Sanctuary. Give us something to do whilst those idiots are dawdling. Let's see if we can... Cook anything. Apparently I can make gutworm colony. Mongrel, dead meat, nuclear material, and purified water. I kind of want the material on the water, because both those are kind of essential for building materials. I'm not going to waste them right now. 
Let's grab our power armor. Transformers, robots in disguise. This is ugly as sin. Uh, another one I have on lets you do a lot of custom paint jobs on power armor, and some of them look a bad fucking ass. Like, I'm talking full on Mad Max. Like, just awesome looking stuff. So, it always looks a bit like a. Like a freaking race car. Like that sort of thing. I'm not talking about like a like a strip. Like a speed strip or anything like that. Speed strip? What, whatever the hell they call them. Shots of the American Revolution were fired. I'd call that the best omen I've seen since Yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. Oh, bet. We could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. Yeah, you want to Why am I crouching? Why am I crouching? the hell? Hang on. Stop, 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 stop. So do you believe the, uh, okay. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, I used to live here before the war. Why does he crouch? What the hell? What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying? I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. I woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. How dare you? you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Why does a mod give you the option to make a gaggle of tapeworms? I have no idea. Uh, just my son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Have you seen Sean? I'm sorry. Carl? I hope you find him. Carl! Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. Give me money, guns, and women. I'm gonna need all three. And I hope you don't mind. But I've got another favor to ask. Oh, you son of a bitch. word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there. Somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? Sure, but I'm not doing it right now. That's fantastic. Many men could use more people like you. We've got By a the way, ass over here. If you Hooray. want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. They gave me a shitload of EXP. Alright. Let's go back over here. Why is my character perpetually crouching? Why do they keep doing that? There's a very odd bug. Very, very odd. He's doing it. What? Why do you keep sneaking? Stop it! Look, what the shit? Like, I'm not making him do that. There's none of this happened when I was testing. Danger? Why are we in danger? Oh. You're welcome. Or I think we good now. I'm sneaking again. <laughs> what the hell? Maybe it's only the power. Why is it doing it? It's so sh- Look, stop. <laughs> stop, you son of a bitch. I don't understand. We need to get out of the power armor, see if he keeps doing it. Alright, get out of the power armor. Okay, is he gonna keep sneaking? Because you, you like, you gotta stop that shit, man. Alright, so here's another mod that I have. You can push people. So if they get in your way, you can be like, fuck you. I said, you fuck you. You're in the damn way. My god, he went flying. So, uh, yeah. That's pretty handy. But also, it's important. At least I think so, because when you do the, um... The, like, stealth kill thing I was telling you about. Oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. When you do the stealth kill thing, you'll see if I do on her. Stand still. Mama Murphy, stop it! Sanctuary. Stand still. I knew you'd join us here, kid. Your energy is tied to this place. God damn it, I'm in a conversation. Hang on. No, stop, stop talking to me! Ah! She won't leave me alone. Oh, God, I gotta finish this conversation, then I'll beat her up. I right, know. Okay, we good, we good, we good. Stop, 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 stop. I don't think you can do it when she's moving. Stop it. Stop it. Mama said knock you out. Hang on. Walk, damn you. Oh, she's aggro. This is bad. No, dog meat. No, it's a bad dog meat. Let's reload. I can't seem to pull it off right now, and I don't know why, but it's kind of annoying. Um. Huh. Let's try, uh, where's Jun? I could do it to him. I know I could. There you go. So that's the, uh, that's the self kill, but when you do it with, like, a gun equipped, it has, like, custom animations for knives and things, I think. So, he's just gonna stay like this. 
God damn, I didn't mean to do that. He's just gonna stay like that. I don't think he ever like gets back up off the ground unless I move him. So the only way I found to fix that was to do the push. So for example, like, I could talk to him. Hey, do you have a moment? You see what I mean? Thank you for helping us out in Concord. If only we'd run into you sooner. You got lucky, but I think your luck's running up. You think we don't know that? Look at us. We're barely keeping it together. I could tell. We've been through hell. You have your My head son. trapped in a power armor station. He's gone. Your son too. Snap. Jinx. I win. Uh, we can berate him. Your son, what was his name? That's awful. No parents should lose a child. You were his dad. It was your job to protect him. You failed. I understand how you feel. I, I lost someone too. Also my son. What a convenient, you know, uh, coincidence. But you and I, we're still here, right? <laughs> I'd like to thank you the only way I know how. For them. <laughs> I mean, I know there's not many people left alive, but there are some women. I don't. I'm not. I'm not for the anal sex. I appreciate the offer. Thank you. See that that fixes them. And then you can be like, get out of here. All right. And then you can be like, get out of here. I enjoy that immensely. Also, really enjoy you know building something very high, getting them up there, and then pushing them off. That's fun too. Right. So, anyway, oh, there's a typewriter. Stuff to loot. Yoink. Lucky yoink. You willing to do some work? What do you want? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground. My face fixed again. Do I look like a goddamn copper to you? I don't know what you look like. You said you were willing to help. Making beds is what we need help with. Well, I'm about to do this stuff, man, but like, piss off. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll do that. However, uh, I know there's a farm really nearby where you can steal a bunch of food. I don't... I think it might be this. So let's put a, put a marker there. We're going to head to that farm and rob them of all their food. Because you need food for your settlement. Water we can get. The food is kind of harder to come by. So that's going to be the plan. Hey, Marcy. How's it going? Alright. Let's go. So we're going to explore that. See if we can find some food there. See what's going on at the farm. Maybe we'll rob them and kill them. I don't know yet. I'm not sure. Uh, it, it, basically, if it can be a settlement where they are, I guess we won't kill them. If it can't be, we're probably going to rob them blind and murder them. You like the map overhaul mod? Me too. It looks very cool. And it's bloody hand. Look how pretty it is. Look at it. In some ways, the game looks a bit like Skyrim now, which, I don't know, I'm kind of down with that. Mumba said, knock you out. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go get food from this place, and then we can actually build some stuff. Probably not going to be doing any building uh, today, because it is currently almost 1am, and I haven't eaten yet. I had a smoothie, so suffice to say, I'm bloody hungry. Mama said, knock you out. Bitch! Yoink! Don't mind if I do. I do have some uh, custom enemies, like mods on. There's not too many that were on the Nexus. There's some spiders. Uh, I don't think they show up in too many places. There's these, like, weird sort of Night Stalker things. Basically, uh, kind of like the ones in New Vegas. And, you know, again, I have uh, a bunch of overhauls on for, like, the Raiders and what have you. So, there's a decent amount more variation than there was previously. So, yeah, this is the place. I really feel like that, yeah, look. It's totally a settlement because of that. By the way. You can murder this kitty and then dangle it in the faces of the owners, and they don't care. Now, I'm going to do it, but I'm going to save and reload. I would, Look, I don't condone murdering of kitties, right? What but I just want to show you. Up, okay, hang on. You need, look, I just, I just want to show you how bad, no, like, AI God. can be in video games, right? If we no, sneak attack God, this, and then we dangle no, it in front of them, no. they have... Oh, God. No. Sorry. And then we dangle no. it in front of them, then they don't know. Oh, God, they're right there. Go away. I'm trying to murder your kitty so I can show you. Again, I don't condone this. I'm not actually going to kill the cat. I'm going to reload afterwards, but I just want you to see how it works. The cat's kind of adorable. How are we detected? Right, so. Watch this shit, right? Oh god, no! Never mind. Never mind, I take it back. But you just got to trust me on that, right? If you sneak attack the cat, you can literally dangle it in their faces and they have no idea. I don't know, it's just kind of funny to me. But we're not going to murder the cat because, you know, I'm not that much of a monster. I am going to rob these people, though. Because I am that much of a monster. Mumba said, knock you well. Uh, another mod I have uh, lets you actually have planters 
for the food. So instead of having these weird stalk things, they're actually in planters, which means you could, I don't know, it's just neater and they don't clip as much and, you know, float and what have you. Ah, it looks cool. I like it. I'm robbing these people, though. All right. Any of you got anything important to say? Here for work? We could use some help picking melons if you've got some spare time. I'll give you caps for any you can bring me. Uh, you had too much chance to install M's Abominations. I actually didn't find that mod, even though I looked through, like, thousands of them. What's M's Abominations? Did you say caps? Why would I want you? Yeah, Lowe's. You look like you have a pretty successful farm here. Ah, uh, well, let's, let's, you know, play it dumb and pretend we don't understand what caps are and why they're important. Why would I want those? Yeah, like, bottle caps? And because it's money? Uh, at least it is here in the Commonwealth. I don't know why my guy's standing like that. Um, I think, I think I hit a button that made him go into cover, because I have a mod that lets you uh, essentially use cover, you know? Like, you can hide on corners and stuff like that. I think he's doing that, but out in the middle of nowhere, so he looks odd, but whatever. Uh, you look like you have a pretty successful farm to me. We'd like to think so. Having Clarabelle helps. It is a cool pose. fertilizer, as Daddy would say. Whatever saves caps. Clarabelle, who's that? Isn't that the cow or something? Claire is our Brahmin. I like to consider her just as much a part of the family as Maisie. Yeah, with She's two heads. Cat, in case you were going to ask about her too. Yeah, I already murdered your cat like four times. Uh, what's a Brahmin? Did my daddy put you up to this? That big two-headed animal in the pen with patchy fur? That's a Brahmin. That's our Clara. You guys want... Wait, you guys pay for things with bottle caps? What happened to dollars and cents? That old stuff? Not too useful these days. Unless you're looking to stock up your outhouse. Oh, it's a bunch of joke enemies like super gorillas and dolphin invaders and space squids. It sounds kind of cool, but at the same time, again, even though I have 255 mods, I've tried to keep them, you know, making sense. So, no, I, but I didn't even see that one. Okay, I'll do it. Great. Doesn't have to be now, but whenever you get the time. Yeah, it won't be now, darling. I'll, I'll spoil that for you. Right, so, uh... How did I, uh... How did I get into cover, and how do I stop being in cover? I don't know how I did this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Alright, hang on. I think we might have a thing for take cover. I don't see it. Son of a bitch. Oh, take cover configuration. Here we go. What button is it? I don't know. Take cover. If I click it, will he just... Okay, there we go. That, that fixes it for now. It's one of the buttons makes him do that. And I thought it was Z, but it's not working. Or Z. It ain't working. I don't know. Fuck it. Oh, I didn't lose this one. Like yoink. Okay. So we've got the food. Let's have a look at our journal. Find out what's going on. Uh, data. Okay. Build shell beds for sanctuary. The first step. Look to the settlers at Ten Pins Bluff. Jewel of the Commonwealth. Go to Diamond City. And optional, listen to Cassadin Caravan Radio. Uh, I don't know if that's like a DLC or something. I have no idea. But now, we're going to mark the sanctuary one. Let's see if we can rob these falls. So yeah, obviously, oh, it's the kitty that I murdered. So obviously this can at some point, oh, it's got a ball. That's adorable. Obviously at some point this can be a settlement. So I don't know if there's really that much point in me robbing it right now because I could probably take all this stuff for free later. But if there's something really important that we could take right now, for example, a stim pack could be bloody handy. Well, then we will. So let's just take a quick look. I'm not going to pick up all the crap, like I say. Hey, get up, get up. What? What? It's still that thing with the text like bugging out on the screen where it just sits there occasionally. I just don't know why. It's bloody annoying. Oh, ammo. Fantastic. More ammo. Oh my god. Glorious. Mmm, cigarettes. That's mostly fine. Alright, let's check upstairs real quick. And then we'll get the crap out of here now. He basically jack shit up here. All right. Let's be careful, because I really don't know how far we can fall in this game without dying. Okay, we good. Right, let's go back to Sanctuary. Uh, where the hell is it? There it is. So, the next order of business will be to uh, do up Sanctuary. 
Uh, in other words, I'm going to scrap like all that rubble you've seen on the floor. I'm going to get rid of the completely broken buildings. I am going to somewhat decorate, uh, you know, some of the places. Like, for example, this, this is probably going to be the main sort of hub area, I guess. That's our house. I'll do that at some point as well. I'm going to redo this whole section. So, like, I'll redo the kitchen. I'll redo the furniture. I'll probably redo the bathroom. I might turn this into, like, a weight room or something. But I'm probably going to do that off camera, or at least I'll do it next stream. I'm not entirely sure yet. Again, it depends. Uh, I'm probably going to throw the poll up tomorrow, like, before the stream. Because uh, I will be streaming tomorrow. Uh, and tomorrow's probably not going to be Fallout 4. We'll probably do uh, Zelda or something tomorrow. And that way I'll give like a couple of days for people to give me feedback and let me know how much of the building they want to see. If they just want me to do it off camera and then sort of walk you through what I've done. Or if we do it sort of, you know, like the last half of the Fallout 4 streams. I don't know yet. I, I, like I said, I'll, I'll throw up a poll on YouTube and uh, Twitter and whatnot. But yes, that is going to do for today's stream. I'm hungry. I'm going to go eat. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Like I say, next time we will, uh, I will have either already done this place up, or I will do it on camera. And then we will carry on our journey, searching around, finding stuff. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the stream. I will see you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. And goodbye. Alrighty, thank you very much for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And thank you especially to this month's $10 plus tier patrons. They are as follows. Nuria Age, Don Lobo, I'll be jiggered, Billy Nying, Dr. Piper Penguin, Bad Beauty, Philip Rep, aka Bebop56210, Grandpa Gus, Source of Success, and Hitbox. And thank you to all of the $5 plus tier patrons, as well as Twitch subscribers for this month, who should be listed on the screen right about now. And thank you very much to everybody in the lower tier as well. If you would like to become a patron, you can do so at patreon.com slash LP. But most of all, just thank you for watching. Good night, everybody, and goodbye.